In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Ngayon po ay memorial ni St. Bernard, Abbot and Doctor of the Church. Prepare ourselves, celebrate the sacred mysteries, let's call to mind our sins, be truly sorry for them. I confess, Almighty God, and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I failed to do. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault, therefore I ask, Blessed Mary, ever virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God of mercy and us forgive us our sins, bring us everlasting life. Amen. Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy. Christ of mercy. Christ of mercy. Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy. Let us pray. O God, who made of the abbot St. Bernard a man consumed with zeal for your house, and the light shining and burning in your church. Grant to his intercession that we may be on fire with the same spirit, walk always as children of light, through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the beginning of the book of Ruth. Once in the time of the judges, there was a famine in the land. So a man from Bethlehem of Judah departed with his wife and two sons to reside on the plateau of Moab. Elimelech, the husband of Naomi, died, and she was left with her two sons who married Moabite women, one named Orpah, the other Ruth. When they had lived there about ten years, both Malon and Chilion died also, and the woman was left with neither her two sons nor her husband. She then made ready to go back from the plateau of Moab, because word reached her there that the Lord had visited his people and given them food. Orpah kissed her mother-in-law goodbye, but Ruth stayed with her. Naomi said, See now, your sister-in-law has gone back to her people and her God. Go back after your sister-in-law. But Ruth said, Do not ask me to abandon or forsake you, for wherever you go, I will go, wherever you lodge, I will lodge. Your people shall be my people, your God, my God. Thus it was that Naomi returned with the Moabite daughter-in-law, Ruth, who accompanied her back from the plateau of Moab. They arrived in Bethlehem at the end of the barley harvest. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Praise the Lord, my soul. Praise the Lord, my soul. Blessed is he whose help is the God of Jacob, whose hope is in the Lord his God, who made heaven and earth, the sea, and all that is in them. Praise the Lord, my soul. The Lord keeps faith forever, secures justice for the oppressed, gives food to the hungry. The Lord sets captives free. Praise the Lord, my soul. The Lord gives sight to the blind. The Lord raises up those who are bowed down. The Lord loves the just. The Lord protects strangers. Praise the Lord, my soul. The fatherless and the widow he sustains, but the way of the wicked he thwarts. The Lord shall reign forever. Your God, O Zion, 
through all generations. Alleluia. Praise the Lord, my soul. Please stand. Teach me your paths, my God. Guide me in your truth. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. When the Pharisees heard how Jesus had silenced the Sadducees, they came together, one of them a teacher of the law, tried to test him with this question, Teacher, which is the most important commandment in the law? Jesus answered, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the first and most important of the commandment. But after this, there's another one very similar to, to it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. The whole law and the prophets are founded on these two commandments. Brothers and sisters, the gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Magandang umaga po sa lahat. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary, Banawag. St. Matthew's message today is about the Pharisees. Mga taong kilalang marurunong, mauutak, at maraming alam sa kanilang bayan. Siyempre, kung mautak ka, kung marunong ka, the strongest temptation is ipaalam mo sa iyong katabi na ikaw ay may utak, marunong, maraming alam. Di ba? Man is by nature proud. Pride is the mother of all sins. Kayabangan. Mag-ingat tayo sa kayabangan. Kasi nandiyan parati ang demonyo. At madali tayo magyabang kung ano ang meron tayo. Kung anong alam natin. Kung anong nasa wallet natin. Ay, kakaawa naman. Kayabangan. Pride is the mother of all sins. Lahat ng kasalanan pinapanganak ng kayabangan. Ano ang ating ipagdarasal ngayon kay St. Bernard at saka kay Kristo during the Mass? Lord, grant me the grace to be humble. Papakumbaba. At alam ko, pag hindi akong papakumbaba, walang grasyang darating sa akin. Sarado ang puso sa Diyos. Sarado. Malaki ang obstacle ang nakaharap. At so, ngayon, nakikita nyo inaayos sa likod, nasa harap natin. The mother at my left and the son at my right. Swerte naman natin. Gawa ng may inaayos sa likod, Napalapit sa atin ang birhen dito. Tumiga, tingnan niyo ang mahal na birhen. 
Dati-dati ang layo niya, doon sa taas. Ngayon, napalapit. Dala-dala ang kanyang anak. At nandito sa kanan ko, Blessed Sacrament. Tandaan niyo, sa Blessed Sacrament, e merong tao. There is a person there na pwede niyong hingin at ialay lahat ng inyong mga hinaing sa puso, sa problema. Hindi natin kaya ang ating pasariling problema. Ialay niyo sa Kanya. Lord, kayo na nga po ang bahala sa mga problema ko. Gagawin ko na lang ay to be humble, magpakumbaba para naman duma dumating sa akin ang grasya mo. Pag mayabang tayo, ang saradong sarado ang puso. Walang darating na grasya. Pag mayabang, nabubulok sa kanyang sarili. Pag mapakumbaba, nabubuhay at dumarating sa kanya lahat ng grasya binibigay ng Panginoon lahat na hindi natin alam dumarating e kung hindi natin alam na dumating na ang ating nasal ay dapat pasasalamat Sal salamat po Diyos. Thanksgiving parate. Pasalamat. Iyan ang sinyal na tayo'y mga taong merong dangal. Marunong magpasalamat. Pag hindi marunong magpasalamat, hindi ko alam kung saan tayo Pupulutin. We now all stand for the prayers of the faithful. Magsitayo po tayo. Yan. Let our prayers show that we love the Lord God with all our heart, with all our soul, mind, and strength. Let our prayers show that we love our neighbors as we respect and reverence ourselves. Ang ating sagot po, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That the Church, through its leaders, may bring the faithful to a deeper knowledge and love of God. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That obedience to God's law may guide those who govern us. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer that our homes may be places of God's presence, where everyone is taught to care and respect one another as a child of God. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That by the gentle touch of the Spirit, we may have a deeper compassion for the sick and the elderly. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer that Christ may bring to his eternal kingdom our departed loved ones. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Pagdasal po natin ang mga hindi na nagsisimba at ipagdasal po natin ating sarili na bumalik tayo sa kumpisalan. Lord God, you reveal your will to us through your commandments. As we bring these petitions before you, give us the grace to live out these commandments. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. 
Please be seated. Please stand. Pray, brethren, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. May the sacrifice which you gladly present on this feast of blessed Bernard be pleasing to you, O God, for taught by him we to give ourselves entirely to you in praise through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let's give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. Truly right and just our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father. Almighty, eternal God, for your praise in the company of your saints, and in crowning their merits, you crown their own gifts. By their own way of life, you offer us an example. By communion with them, you give us companionship. By their intercession, sure support, so that encouraged by so great a cloud of witnesses, we may run as victors in the race before us and win with them the imperishable crown of glory. To Christ our Lord, and so with the angels and archangels, and with the great multitude of the saints, we sing the hymn of your praise, as without end we acclaim, Holy. Holy, Holy Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory, Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord, Hosanna in the highest. Please kneel. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, this gifts we pray, sending down your spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time was betrayed, entered willingly into his passion, took bread, giving thanks, broke it, gave it his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, took the chalice once more, giving thanks, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for there is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. When we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim your death, O Lord, until you come again. And therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life, the chalice of salvation, giving thanks of held as worth 
to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray, partaking of the body and blood of Christ, you be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world. Bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, Socrates, our Archbishop, Fidelis, his auxiliary, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection. All have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray. Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the blessed apostles, Saint Dominic and all the saints of please you throughout the ages. May Mary to be co heirs to eternal life. May praise and glorify you, your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, with him, in him, O God, Almighty Father, the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Please stand. Let us now pray with confidence to the Father in the words the Savior taught us. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days. And by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin, safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope for the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ said to our apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. Peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Lamb of God. You take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. Yung mga kararating lang na hindi nagsimba, ang advice ko sa inyo, huwag mo na magkumunyon at hindi kayo nagsimba. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Let us pray. Please stand. As we celebrate the divine mysteries, O Lord, we pray. May the Holy Spirit fill us with the light of faith, by which he constantly enlightened blessed Bernard, for the spreading of your glory through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated for the announcement. Brothers and sisters, good morning. The Dominican community of the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag is pleased to inform you that the October Feast of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag will be on October 3, 2021, first Sunday of October. The Novena Masses will be scheduled at 6 a.m., 7.30 a.m., 9 a.m., 10.30 a.m., 12 noon, and 4.30 p.m. from September 24 to October 2, 2021. Additional Mass at 3 p.m. on September 26, Sunday. We invite you to participate in this Novena Masses and be one with us in expressing our devotion to Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. If you wish to sponsor one or several of the Novena Masses, you may fill out the form at the counters for Masses area and submit it with your donation, and you will be given an acknowledgement receipt. Or you may visit our website, www.manawagminorbasilica.org at Online Pamisa, where you will find available online and other options for donations. All names of donors and sponsors for Novena Masses will appear in the electronic Sobiner program. Thank you very much for your continued support. God bless you. Please stand. Blessing of the sick. God Almighty Father, by your blessing, give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness towards our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from our illness, restore them to good health. Through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, we will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Blessing of religious articles. In memory of the mysteries of life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, to the honor and glory of Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, our Lady, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary, Manawag. May these rosaries, images, and other religious articles be blessed made holy in the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Maraming salamat po. Punta niyo rito, pagsimba niyo rito sa Our Lady of the Rosary, Manawag. Sana ay maituwid ang ating masasamang ugali at tayo ay matuluyan magrosaryo para naman Matulungan tayo ng mahal na birhen, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. The Lord be with you. And with your May spirit. May Almighty God bless us all. The Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. We go in peace. Thanks be to God.